Hey guys, what's up? It's Amazing Potatoes here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to build using basic bar barn items. Yeah, I can speak English. Every video I have a problem pronunciating something. And I almost screwed up saying pronunciate. Anyways, Sanctuary has been put on hold mostly because I do not like Sanctuary. It's really repetitive building everything there and I just do not find it fun at all. Both Far Harbor and most of the other settlements I do find fun and interesting. And I realize I'm starting to get better with my building, especially with the new addition to barn items. Now barn items are something you can build out of in Fallout 4. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to build something pretty cool. I'm going to build some sort of bar hotel mixture. And the funny thing is, the bar is going to be on the second floor, which is odd. Um, this is going to be a two video series. It's not going to be a series at all. It's just going to be two parts. And let's get started. So I did cheat, and I do have basically over 5,000 everything. Uh, I have a crap ton of steel, and I have a crap ton of uh, well, wood and glass. So that's basically all you need to uh, build a crap ton of anything in this game. Especially in Far Harbor. So we are building on Longfellow's Cabin. If you guys are wondering where this place is, if you don't have Far Harbor. It's um, a new addition, a new settlement, that you get this whole entire island. It's basically like a tiny version of Spectacle Island. But it does have some areas that are irradiated. So I try to build out of those areas, but I do have somewhere that cleans it. I'll introduce that when I actually make a tour of this place. So let's get started. So what you need to do is, of course, you're gonna go. You're gonna need Far Harbor, of course, and you're gonna need um, a crap ton of wood and glass. Now if, you may have to collect materials in order to build this, and that's perfectly fine. Um, I'm gonna be building sort of like a barn, like a really like western kind of cowboy. Um, feel to it like you know that Hatfield McCoy stuff um, you know those like restaurants that show that stuff it's a uh, kind of have barn doors and they're gonna be opening inward now those are pretty hard to do but um, you can make it work so you see this we're gonna see if this opens inward yes it does that means it's an inward door we're gonna go over here we're gonna look at this door we're gonna flip it and if we can't get into this we may have to use this one. Let's see if this one connects and goes inward. That one goes outward. We don't want that. Scrap you. We have to use one of these. Okay, we're gonna have to fiddle with this until it gets it. It's not all the way on, but hey, it, it works. I should probably close these. The reason why you want to go inward, because only barn items, like barn stairs, connect to these really well. And it looks pretty ugly on the outside, but trust me, when you're, when you're, it looks a lot better when you're done. Now, I really do like clean building, so I'm going to try to use just the basic same item over and over again. Luckily, um, the walls are extremely just odd that you won't be able to tell that they're the same wall unless if you just really focus and look hard on it. Just due to the, you know, strange design in the glass. And also, it kind of looks the same way in real life if you smash the same window open over and over again. All right, now that's done. We're gonna basically save the interior walls after because building interior walls are extremely hard without a roof. Surprisingly, the roof actually makes interior walls just look better without prefabs in barns. Now, if you do have shack, um, shack upper floor, okay, my bad, shack foundations, I don't know why that one's a shack upper floor, but if you have a bunch of shack foundations, um, it makes barns look really good with interior walls. All right, so I have to get nighttime, so this is going to be pretty hard to see. So, fortunately, I'm going to go to sleep. And I'm not going to edit this out because I'm lazy and I are already going to be having to edit a few things in. At least I think I will. Maybe I won't. Um, maybe I might edit this out. I don't know. But we're going to sleep for a little bit and then we're going to continue our building. This is what I have to deal with while building. So, I mean, I'll just leave it in the video. Why not? We're going to wait until p.m. Or eh, 7 p.m. should be good enough. It might be a little foggy, but it'll work. Now they're awake, we can go back out. 
Um, that's fantastic. Radiation storm. Real cute. Real cute. Uh, I can't even tell you're having a radiation storm. The whole place always looks irradiated. Alright, so now... Um, these are kind of a pain, but, you know, we can't really get rid of them. We're gonna start building the second floor. Let's close this door. Now, I like having a weird kind of design. Um, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Skyrim. We're gonna build the upper floor, but we're gonna leave two areas open. We're gonna build this. We're gonna leave this open, right here. Um, that's not clipping. It's not clipping. It's not good. We're gonna build this way then. Actually, this poses a new idea. Thank you, door. Actually gave me a great idea. I'm gonna use that as like a nice little, we'll put like a fence around it. We built the whole entire upper floor. You know, it just says floor, it doesn't say upper floor. You're still, you can still just use floors. Works just as good. And then we're gonna put, um, I don't wanna use that that way. This way, return, there we go. Use that one like that. And this one, we're gonna do it like this. And you'll find out why. Just use these uh, half floors if you do have the materials for it. Just use half floors. And then you could put stairs down. For some reason, the long stairs for barns just seem to never work nearly as well as the big ones, so we're gonna use the long ones here, and we're gonna use the thick ones here. Just add some variety in there. Now this is gonna be kinda of annoying because I'm not sure if you can build on top of this, and we're about to find out. Okay, good, you can. That almost gave me a tiny heart attack because that would have meant we've done all of this for nothing, and that's the wrong type of material. I mean, wrong type of wall. We can use these walls, because, like I said, it looks nice. Enough to use, I guess. I was quite disappointed to find out uh, the bank safe vaults. Not like vaults, like underground vaults where people thrive in. The bank safes, you know, the vaults for the bank safe, are a mod, I believe. I don't think you can get that in the base game. So that kind of broke my heart, but it's all good. I was going to use that for this place, by the way. So what we're going to do now is we're going to need four of these. Do this. We're going to do this as our roof. The upstairs is going to basically be our bar area, not our restaurant. Our restaurant is across the street. Or at least I like to think it is. I'm going to leave this area because this area is going to be where the actual bar is. This area I'm going to put a... A fence around so it's like an actual barn we're gonna use these because these just look really nice when you're actually done trust me it will now the weird thing is we're gonna go back to roof I'm gonna do this and strangely enough it's gonna look like a normal barn like everything you build at first looks just kind of odd with barns it looks just kind of like a huge square. But when you do something like this, it looks like an actual legit barn. Now, of course, we're going to fence that over. In fact, let's do that right now because it's starting to get a wee bit annoying. Now, those fences are just ugly. We're going to go to wood and miscellaneous. And we're going to use these. I'm going to switch them up with that. Switch back to that. Uh, that one there. Of course, you can just. Hmm. Hmm. Why do you have to do that? That just makes me sad. Well, oh, we can put them over each other so we can do it like that. That's kind of cool. Now, let's see if we can do it with this. Come on, let's flip it around. Come on. Come on. Alright, you're, you're not cooperating. Let's try something else. Just put that one there. Hmm. It's good enough, I guess. It's a little too great. Now that's done. We're going to have to fill up these holes. And that's pretty easy to do. 
I suppose. I mean, it's kind of hard since you're not able to actually reach up all the way up there. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this. That part's not too hard. Sometimes you might oh, mess up like I just did. I don't know why this is in more. That's not supposed to have it be. Oh, there we go. So that one's backwards. <sighs> this is going to happen a lot. Now, I'm going to go to kind of like the... I would like to call them like corner pieces because they are sort of that. Put one here. Mm. Put one here. Put one here. And put one here. We're clearly running out of settlement space, but it's alright. We can just fix that later. Now, this is the part where it gets tricky because building up there, you're going to need at least some sort of stepping stool. And we're going to use a big stepping stool. Like, huge. Friggin'. You know that squatty potty commercial? You're going to need one of those. You're going to have to buy the big fat man version of the squatty potty in order to do this. God, I love that commercial. I'm not sure if it's an actual product, but it, it's, it's the best freaking commercial ever. It actually made me go to freaking Baskin Robbins once. If you guys don't know what Baskin Robbins is, it's just a place where you can buy ice cream. All right, so we're gonna go over here and do it on this side now. Yeah, do that. And we're gonna look for another. I'm gonna use the small one. I don't know where it is. Here it is. And let's use the last two corner pieces. One here. Please don't fall. One here. And basically when you're done with that, you can just scrap these. You don't even need to store them because you're probably never going to use them again unless if you build another building this tall. So, interior decorating is going to be my next video. This is kind of just the base of it. And it doesn't look that bad, I suppose. I guess it looks a little repetitive, but... Hey, if you go all the way around, it doesn't look that bad. So, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like, subscribe, do whatever you want. I don't care, it's your life. Bye!